All right, Rowan, notebook of lamb. It's the new kid on a blog. Tell me all about it. It sure is. We've got five minutes, so we've got to be quick. Notebook LM is an experimental new AI service provided by Google literally for anyone in the world to use okay. at no cost. And it allows you to take vast quantities of data in and produce very helpful outputs as a return. So the first thing we need to do is open a new tab in the browser and type in notebooklm.google.com. And we can provide it with a title, which can be Cobrake AI Campaign. So you'll see that the interface is split into this three sections, a bit like a sausage machine. There's the inputs, the process, and then the outputs on the right hand side. I love sausages. All right, yeah, so <laughs> let's start with the sources, right? Well, let's chuck in uh, our website first, maybe. Okay, so when I click add source, there's four main categories of sources. You can upload files, you can link to Google Drive documents, which is great because as you know, they're live and updating and so we'll always reference the latest version. It means you don't have to re-upload them, right? And, exactly, and there's also links to websites or YouTube videos and finally pasted text. Cool. So now that we're basically feeding mints into our sausage machine, how does this sausage machine work? Exactly. So now we have these sources added, there are a number of things that Notebook's already done without us even providing any prompt. Sure. For example, there's a summary in the section in the middle here with all of the sources included, but equally I can also get a summary of the individual sources. If I click onto one of them on the left hand side, I can see not only the content itself, but a summary as well and key topics, which if I click on them, it will then do a deep dive into, for example, sustainable practices within Cobra. All right, so how is this different to, let's say, just doing this in Gemini or ChatGPT? So how this is unique compared to Gemini is that Google have fine-tuned this to be really focusing on accuracy versus creativity. Right. So it may not be the best for brainstorming new ideas, but for understanding content accurately and pulling out various pieces of it to provide helpful uh, outputs, this is exactly what Notebook LM is. Yeah, so one thing that I've found definitely is with ChatGPT and Gemini and all the other kind of large language models that they tend to what we call hallucinate uh, in the sense that they just mix things up, right? So if I'm asking about sustainability practices for Cobra, it will go into the internet or find some things, but chances are we'll probably make something up as it's, as it's going along. Um, whereas here I can see, for example, um, we know we've got our ISO certifications and I see a little like one bubble there, which probably means that it's referencing a source that we've provided. That's right. So if you click on any of these numbers, you can actually select and find the exact source yeah. material. And there's a sustainability slide. Exactly. Amazing. So about the section on the right, I can see that we're generating a conversation. Well, we'll get back to that in the end, Victor. Okay. What about notes? Okay, so notes are the outputs that you want to save for future reference. So there's a number of different preset formats, which I can just one click create an FAQ section, which is saved for me to use again. But equally, I can also, if I type into chat and do a more custom prompt, like for example, this sustainability practice, I can click save to note, and it then adds into this section where, where I can come back. And that allows us to kind of see what we've queried before, and also allow us to create, create almost like a knowledge base of that distilled information. That's right. And we can actually get a number of helpful outputs from the same source material. So for example, in our campaign, we may want website pages, we want, may want email marketing, we might want to create uh, the content for a YouTube video. We could do all of that in the same notebook. Right, so let's say we want to ask, uh, create a content plan around uh, AI strategy. Let's do it. All right, so we've got a four-phase strategy around how we can execute an AI strategy. Amazing. So. That actually looks pretty helpful. So how can you send this my way? Just copy and paste it into chat or? Well, this is the beauty of Notebook. Like many of the other Google services, I can share this for you to collaborate live with me. All right, just like a Google Doc. Exactly. So just in the same way, I click share at the top, right? I can enter your name and I can also provide you with different levels of access. So of course, just like a Google Doc, right? Exactly. I may want you to just view it or for you to edit it, which I can select here. Awesome. I'm thinking of so many use cases for this. Like imagine you're a lawyer and you've got a case that you're working on, thousands of documents, or maybe not thousands, hundreds of documents, hundreds of pages. You know, you just need to distill that information and query maybe certain uh, laws that pertain to your case. Or let's say you're an engineer and you're working on uh, a new geography when there's more regulations, different regulations to the one that you're used to. Chuck in the, you know, the, the massive book of all the different building regulations and standards that there are. Notebook LM can distill it and then you can just ask questions as, as if you were asking an expert, right? It's almost like a, right. a friend that can distill all this information that you give it and then give it to you in a conversational, nice, easy to parse format. Speaking of easy to parse formats, I can see that our audio reviews uh, finished generating. Yes, so this is the coolest feature of Notebook, which actually went semi-viral. There's a lot of people posting about it online and on social media. And it's a very unique feature where you can create an audio overview, which is essentially a podcast of two hosts speaking about your content. No way. So let's have a listen. Welcome everybody. Today we're diving deep into Cobra a Google Cloud partner. Focusing on workspace. So that genuinely sounds like a podcast. 
It's incredible. And the latest feature from Google, and this is a beta mode, is an interactive mode where you can actually join in the conversation yourself and interact with the host live. No way. You want to try it out? Yeah, yeah, go on. Hey, Gary, what's up? Uh, hi. I was wondering what are the different Cold Breeze services that they offer around data and analytics? Yeah, it's good to get into the specifics, especially with a company like Cold Breeze. Okay, so when it comes to data and analytics, they've got a few key offerings. Let's unpack this. What's fascinating here is their focus on helping businesses actually make use of their... Not bad, huh? That's incredible. So does that kind of sum things up? It does. So in summary, Victor, three main sections, sources, inputs you provide, chat, which is the way that you interact and get the outputs and then the outputs themselves. That's the three main sections and that's the process within Notebook. Essentially, you want to be thinking about any time where you have to analyze and work with vast quantities of data, especially from different sources uh, or different content types and provide some kind of output, especially in a written format. That's where Notebook LM is fantastic. So I guess, yeah, I guess that's us. That's, that's Notebook LM in a nutshell. Yeah. Hope you learned something there as well.